Hi everyone, this is Rosanna and I just wanted to share this card that I made uh, yesterday and some tags that I made a while back but I didn't get the chance to to show them. So let me start with this card. And this is one of the greeting farm uh, stamps. Isn't she lovely? I watercolor her and put some glossy accents over here and use my gel pens on some of the parts. And the paper collection that I used for this card is from Melissa Francis, this one over here. So let's see. Um, the base is the one of the corrugated cards from Michaels. I whitewash everything with gesso. Did some layers uh, from the uh, paper collection. Uh, here is a uh, pearl twin, some clear uh, like bubbles over here, and this is. A prima flower in these other ones are from I found them at Michael's a while back a piece of uh, of the corrugated card over here and then a piece of cheese clock here on the back of hair very simple but I just love it in there and then on the inside uh, another piece of paper the paper collection so this is the card and then let me share the tags and let me just take them so I can show you more close each one so let me start with this one for this one, I use this paper collection from Prima. And as you can see over here, I stamp her on the paper and it was perfect. I just got the Eiffel Tower. Isn't that cute? So then I wrap here a piece of tool. I just very very tiny pearls over here and this um, resin flower on her hair and I paint it so it will match more the colors this is a journaling card over here on the back and I just I use some modeling paste over here pair twin pieces of the paper collection I use this um, punch here I put more of the tool I use my gel pen to color her shoes these flowers over here that I found at Michael's and a piece of lace string and this pearl sprays over here and the base of this is uh, the Prima tags that I just glued two together so this is the first one that I wanted to share let me show you this other one and for this one I used Yeah, this this paper collection from Prima. And let's see, let me show you more close. Let me start over here. Piece of applique, this flower that I made, and put this beautiful uh, ring on the center. Pair of dream, pieces of the paper collection on the back. I did some modeling paste. I cut out 
some butterflies and we use one of my bunches over here fussy cut hair I color her hair with some uh, copics I use my gel pen and this ribbon a very tiny ribbon flower this is a stamp from Prima so this is the other one Then for this one, I used this other paper paper collection from Prima. And let's see. Let me start over here. I made this flower, beautiful flower. Uh, here on the back is a piece of applique. This beautiful pearl trim. I wrap around this string pieces of the paper collection I made this banner a piece of uh, lace trim here on the back I fussy cut, fussy cut hair use my gel pens over here and over here put this tiny flower bling on her hair use my copics to color her hair in this I, I did modeling paste too on this one here on the back I don't know if you can see yeah and this clear um, bubbles over here so this is the other one and the last one I wanted to share so for this one I use this paper collection from Prima Toon and let's see let me start over here this piece um, I um, did different layers of trims over here and I love this one with these beautiful flowers over here I fussy cut her, her dress I put a piece of lace here on the back of her dress use my gel pens here and here I and, and her earrings too this is a journaling card here on the back that I just did like a frame and put this other trim over here and use my copics to color her hair in this beautiful crown that I have it on my stash and I I don't know if you can see it's very shimmery over here I I did some modeling paste too and uh, it's very shimmery over here all around because I use some embo uh, some embossing powder that has a uh, glitter I don't know if you can see it in the back it's just simple So this is the other one. So I have them just in case I need something um, that I can keep. So I just have them right there. <laughs> Maybe put a, a piece of trim here on the top. Or something and that's it so these are my share for today so thanks everybody for watching I hope you get inspired and create and as always uh, thanks 
for your beautiful comments, for subscribing, and talk to you guys later. Bye.